Hal Jordan will be part of the new DC Universe, and some actors could help make the Green Lantern one of the most beloved characters of the rebooted universe. Hal Jordan's only live-action role so far came in 2011's Green Lantern, which featured Ryan Reynolds as Hal. While the actor delivered a serviceable turn as the character, Green Lantern was far from the success it should have been, not making good on the character and the franchise potential. Now, the DCU's upcoming movies and series can rectify that mistake. Number 10. Tyrone Egerton could bring Hal Jordan's attitude to life. Hal Jordan has a noble heart and good intentions, but that does not mean that the Green Lantern does not come with an attitude. While nothing on the level of Guy Gardner, another confirmed Green Lantern for the DCU who will debut as part of Superman's cast of characters, played by Nathan Fillion. Paul Jordan can get quite cocky at times. With his role in the Kingsman franchise, Taron Egerton has shown he can match Hall's energy and deliver impactful action sequences. Number 9. Bradley Cooper was rumored to play Hall Jordan in Green Lantern. Bradley Cooper has plenty of experience in superhero business. The actor delivered one of the best performances ever in superhero movies in last year's Guardians of the Galaxy Vol. 3 as Rocket Raccoon. With James Gunn revealing that he wants actors from the Marvel Studios franchise to work with him in the DCU, Cooper's experience as a veteran cosmic hero is perfect for Hal Jordan, with Rocket and Green Lantern sharing the same brand of sarcasm. According to multiple rumors, Cooper was also almost cast as Hal Jordan in 2011's Green Lantern, which plays in his favor. Number 8. Miles Teller could get superhero movie redemption as Green Lantern. Miles Teller played Reed Richards in 2015's Fantastic Four, aka Fantastic. The movie has become commonly regarded as one of the worst superhero movies ever, meeting Reynolds' Green Lantern at the bottom of the list for Marvel and DC entries. Teller has shown with dramatic roles like in Whiplash and action movies such as Top Gun, Maverick that he has the star power and acting skills to do right by a major character like Hal Jordan. In the DCU, Teller could redeem himself for Fantastic Four and the Green Lantern character for audiences. Number 7. Patrick Schwarzenegger is open to playing Hal Jordan. Another actor with superhero experience is Patrick Schwarzenegger. The actor played a small but impactful role as Golden Boy in Prime Video's Gen V, the first The Boys spin-off series. Schwarzenegger's charismatic turn in the show led to the actor becoming a popular fan cast for the DCU's Hal Jordan. While the actor revealed he was not aware of the DC rumors, Schwarzenegger told CBR that he is available to play the Green Lantern if DC wants him for the role. Number 6. John Krasinski's Green Lantern could make up for his wasted MCU role. John Krasinski plays a charismatic character like no other, as his role as Jim Halpert in The Office has cemented. In Prime Video's Jack Ryan, the actor showed that he is adept at action roles, playing a character whose determination is second to none, which makes Krasinski a perfect fit for Hal Jordan. The Green Lantern known for his impressive feats of pure willpower. After years of being fancast as Reed Richards, the Marvel Cinematic Universe wasted Krasinski on a cameo and the DCU could be made better for it. Number 5. Alden Ehrenreich is a fan favorite for the DCU Hall Jordan. Alden Ehrenreich was close to stardom with his role as a young Han Solo in Solo, a Star Wars story. However, the failure of the Star Wars prequel film ended up delaying the actor's career rise. With a small but effective role in the acclaimed Oppenheimer, Aaron Reich should be on the way to a major lead role, and that could come in the DCU.
His Han Solo experience makes him a great casting choice for Hall, who is also an ace pilot whose confidence and sarcasm are second to none. Number 4. James Marston would be great as an experienced Hall Jordan. With the 52-year-old Nathan Fillon cast as the Green Lantern Guy Gardner in the DCU, Gunn could end up going for an actor in the same age range for Hal Jordan, who is the most famous of Earth's Green Lantern. As such, the 50-year-old James Marston would be perfect for the role. The actor has superhero movie experience, having played Cyclops in Fox X-Men franchise, which means he would do great as Hall, becoming one of the DCU's leader. An older Hall Jordan with a younger Jon Stewart would also set up a nice pairing for the DCU's Lantern series. Number 3. Jensen Ackles is great for Green Lantern if he is not DC's new Batman. Jensen Ackles is another actor who would be a solid pick to play a veteran Hall Jordan in the DCU. At 46, Ackles might be too old to play the DC Universe version of Batman, a role which he is the fan favorite for. If he does not play Batman, Green Lantern would be a great second option for Ackles, who has shown in Supernatural and The Boys that he has the charisma and action experience to match the DC hero and can easily bring the emotional depth needed for the character to life flawlessly. Number 2 Zac Efron as Green Lantern would fit the actor's career. Over the years, Zac Efron has been fan cast as several Marvel and DC heroes, with the Hal Jordan version of Green Lantern being at the top of the list on the DC side. As one of the most popular actors today, who has just come off a career best performance in the Iron Claw, Efron would insert some such needed energy into the DCU. Efron has a wide list of roles that display the character's charisma, ability to play sarcastic characters, and physicality for the role of Hal Jordan in the DCU. Number 1. Glenn Powell would be the DCU's perfect Hal Jordan, Green Lantern. Glenn Powell's role as Hangman in Top Gun, Maverick might as well just have been his audition to play the DCU's Hal Jordan. The actor was one of the best parts of the movie, delivering a magnetic performance that made Hangman stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with Tom Cruise Maverick. In the film, Powell excelled as a cocky, skilled pilot. With a little more drive and less humor, Powell's Hal Jordan would be perfect, becoming a strong contender to be the DCU's fan-favorite Green Lantern. Alright, so what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below. And thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did and subscribe, make sure to also like and I will see you next time.